Hello and welcome back to another Motorola live stream. We're here at Motorola HQ. I'm super excited. I cannot wait to get started. My name is Adrian. And I'm Danny. And I'm also very excited because today we announced two new products, the Moto G 5G and the Moto G Stylus 5G. In today's live stream, we're going to be talking about the bells and whistles of the phone, as well as our favorite features. And we do have a lot of favorite sure features do. for sure. Yeah. But not only that, we want to hear from you as well. So let us know if you have any questions about the devices, if there's something that we missed, or along the way, let us know what your favorite features are. A lot of you have already submitted questions earlier today on social media. So thank you so much to those of you that have participated. At the end of the live stream, we're going to be selecting a winner and they're going to win one of these devices, the Moto G Stylus 5G. We're going to be going over all the cool features later today. Uh, so you might have a chance to win. So good luck, uh, but let's jump right in. Yeah. So the first thing that you'll notice about these devices is that they have 5G in their name. Motorola has been at the forefront of 5G innovation, and we've made it our mission to make 5G more widely available. This mission is made true with 5G compatible devices, such as the two that we announced today. So we focus on designing phones at every price point and making 5G available for all. And why is 5G important, right? What does that mean for us as customers? Yeah, imagine everything you currently do on your smartphone, but now faster, more reliable and secure. 5G is a total upgrade to your experience on your phone. You know, and speaking of upgrades, let's start with the Moto G 5G and talk about some of the upgraded experiences on this device. Uh, first of all, I want to talk about this beautiful display. It's a 6.5 inch HD plus display. It also comes with 90 hertz refresh rate. What does refresh rate mean? What does that do for you? What it does is it loads images much faster. So the better the refresh rate, you know, the better your images are going to load. So if you're scrolling through social media, you're uh, loading videos, you're loading content, right? Even if you're just shopping on your phone, it's really going to change that experience for you. Just for reference, on standard smartphones, you're getting about 30 to 60 hertz refresh rate. So at this price point, to get that 90 hertz refresh rate is just incredible. Yeah, that's pretty impressive. Um, and I know that I definitely take take a lot of time to scroll through social media. I know I go hours and hours and then binge watching my favorite shows. Um, so for that, you'll want a really good battery life. So this does come with a 5,000 milliamp battery. Um, so that does give you about two days with one single charge. Uh, one thing that I love about Motorola phones is that they have AI inside of them. Uh, so it's able to kind of understand what you're doing on your phone and then bring down the uh, refresh rate. So that way uh, it's kind of conserving that battery for you. Right, because you're not always gaming, right? You're not no. always streaming uh, those videos. <laughs> Sometimes you're just checking your text messages, just sometimes you're checking email. So you don't need the 90 hertz refresh rate because if you were at that 90 hertz refresh rate, that's gonna drain your battery pretty quickly. So I love that the fact that the AI is built in, it'll recognize what you're doing on a device and it'll uh, you know adjust accordingly to that. Yeah. Uh, the AI is also helps with the camera uh, experience as well. On the Moto G uh, 5G, you're getting a triple camera system on the back of this device. You're getting a 50 megapixel main sensor. You're also getting a dedicated depth sensor, which allows you to take those really great portrait mode images, which blurs out the background, focuses you or the subject. Love those images. Those are still kind of my favorite camera features on Mine there. Too. Uh, it also has a dedicated macro lens. So if you ever seen that photography where they get super up close, you could see, you know, the little hairs on the flower petal, you could see the insects uh, super up close. That's all with the macro photography. So this has it built in. There's a lot of social media pages dedicated to macro photography. Uh, so a lot of cool stuff out there. I know you were mentioning some cool stuff that you recently saw. Yeah, uh, some, we some of the weirdest things that I've seen are definitely like eyes. There's usually like animal eyes. You, I didn't know how how crazy windows they are. to the soul. Yes. Yeah, windows to the soul. Definitely. Yes. And then a cat's tongue. Did you know that cat's tongues hmm. are are sharp? I no, I didn't. And I didn't know that cats stayed still long enough to take <laughs> to take images. I've never had cats are usually very elusive. They're usually running around for me. I can barely pet them, so it's nice that it's very impressive <laughs> just that they stood still for that yeah. image. But yeah, there's a ton of stuff out there, and right now is the perfect time. Right, we're in our gardens. Flowers are blooming. You want to get those up close, cool pictures that you can share on social media, share with your friends and your family. So it's nice that it's built into this device. So again, you're getting that triple camera system. You get 50 megapixels on the main sensor, a dedicated depth sensor, and then also that dedicated macro lens as well. Yeah, this device is gonna come in a color that we call Moonlight Gray with up to six gigs of RAM and 256 gigs of storage. One thing that's great about Motorola phones is that you can also purchase an SD card and actually expand that storage with up to one terabyte. 
that is a lot of storage. Up to 256 gigs is already a lot, right? right? That's a ton of storage uh, on your device. So the ability to expand that memory, if in case you need it, if you're, you know, heavy uh, downloading seasons uh, of your favorite shows, having that all on your phone uh, is going to be really great. So love the fact that you're able to upgrade that and expand uh, that memory as well. Awesome. So let's uh, let's dive into some questions. I know that we have some questions here from the audience. Yeah, yeah, we're seeing a lot of really good questions here. Uh, yes, that green color is super awesome. So yeah, let's see what questions we have. Yeah, I see one on here uh, asking about water protection and the Moto G 5G. Good question. Yes, it is IP52. Uh, so what that protects you from, uh, to keep it easy, right, is a accidental spills and splashes, sweat if you're at the gym, a little bit of rain. Uh, it can't be submerged underwater, uh, but it does come with really good water protection. So which good is, question. It's always good. I know that <laughs> I'm very good. clumsy. Um, does a charger come included? <laughs> it's funny that this is even a question nowadays, but yes, uh, you do get the charger included. You get a 10 watt charger inside the box uh, when you get that. So that's rapid charging. So it gives you a nice um, burst of energy when you're you know at zero empty so really great that it comes with it yeah well thank you for your questions i think we're going to move on to the next uh device here yeah um, uh but first let's recap uh, really quick again this is great if this is your first phone a great phone for mom and dad right so it has all the it checks all the boxes that we're looking for right yeah. it has great camera systems you're getting a triple camera system beautiful display 6.5 inch display with that 90 hertz refresh rate and you're getting that up to two day battery life with the 5000 milliamp battery so again you can and register uh, to have this device. Uh, so you'll be first in line once it becomes available for you. But yeah, let's move on uh, to our next device that we have here. Yeah, so now let's talk about the Moto G Stylus 5G. So this is our fifth generation stylus device. And our stylus devices, our stylus family is actually our best selling device uh, for the Moto G family. My favorite feature here on the Moto G Stylus 5G is that when uh, whenever I pop out the stylus right away, uh, it actually pulls out the Moto Note app. Um, so I can actually go ahead and just take those notes really quickly without having to look through my phone to, to look for an app that's going to be compatible with something that I can handwrite with. So um, very intuitive in that yeah, sense. Yeah, I like that because we've all been there, right? You run into a buddy on the street and you're trying to get their contact information. You don't have a piece of paper and pen. Quickly, you could jot that down before you get on your train or your bus or whatever, and you save it and it's there for you uh, whenever you get back. So okay. a lot of cool things that you can do. Great for shopping lists, a lot of great features uh, to organize and make sure all your notes are kept uh, secure and ready whenever you need them. Not only taking notes, though, I really like the stylus because you could do so many things. It really changes the way I interact with the phone. I find myself just kind of scrolling uh, with the stylus. I have young children. They love using the stylus to doodle and draw. Uh, there's also a really cool coloring book app that Motorola includes on all of our G Stylus devices uh, with some really cool enhanced features as well. It also uses the AI, as we were talking about earlier, uh, to convert your drawings into coloring book pages yeah. and the ai what it'll do it'll start recognizing what you're trying to draw in my case specifically it'll be like oh are you trying to draw a horse this is actually what a horse looks like <laughs> now we we'll use it as a coloring book page not only that but you could also go to your google photos select an image from there and convert that into a coloring book page as well so a lot of great things that you can do uh, with the stylus besides taking notes you could edit photos uh, anything that really uses pinpoint precision you're going to be able to use with this stylus now you were mentioning something uh, cool with text messaging yeah um so this does have handwriting to text recognition so if you wanted to text somebody and actually write it through text you don't have to put them through trying to read your handwriting so it is going to convert that to text um so no one will have to know that you wrote that <laughs> yeah exactly which i feel attacked every time they talk about bad handwriting uh but yes this is really great i was actually testing it out and it's very intuitive yeah. it recognizes whether you're printing cursive whatever bad handwriting great handwriting uh it really is a really great feature it makes it super convenient when you're texting yeah. Not only that, but again, as we were mentioning on the Moto G, uh, 5G, the refresh rate being 90 hertz, this phone takes it to another level with 120 hertz refresh rate. So this is, you know, for that gamer who's doing a little bit more uh, graphics intense type gaming. Uh, if you are uh, streaming a lot of uh, movies or shows, right, this is going to be the device that you're going to want as well. As we were talking about the, the battery life, this also comes with the 5,000 milliamp hour battery. So you're getting great uh, battery life throughout. And again, you combine that with the 5G, you're getting a, a really great experience when you're scrolling through social media or enjoying your favorite content. 
Yeah, and then last but not least on this device, let's talk about the camera. So this does have a 50 megapixel triple camera system uh, with quad pixel technology. I know that's <laughs> that's pretty long to say, yeah. <laughs> uh, but that's gonna take some really sharp, beautiful photos. So that's great. But my favorite feature uh, personally is going to be the optical image stabilization. I have a dog and I love to take thousands of pictures of him uh, and he loves to move when I'm trying to take those pictures of him. So once I take that picture, it's gonna be able to capture that because it has the optical image stabilization. Yeah, sounds like you need a cat because apparently cats <laughs> Cats are standing still now for uh, for <laughs> macro images. So, but yeah, no, I think that's really great, right? With having kids and they're playing sports, you don't want to miss those memories if you know they're shooting the winning shot, right? If it's blurry or shaky, if you're taking a video, that's never a good look, right? So having the OIS built into the phone is really great. You mentioned the quad pixel technology. That's awesome for low light conditions. So now when we're out and about, you know, we're going to more barbecues, we're staying a little bit later, we're at music festivals, the lighting conditions always aren't going to be perfect. So having that quad pixel technology built in is also another added and great feature. Yeah. And actually in some of the comments and in, in some of the chat, uh, we're seeing that people are very excited about these two colors. So let's talk about that. Um, so we do, it does come with a steel blue color and then a seafoam green, which mm. I'm personally most excited excited yeah, about it's a pretty that. awesome color uh, with up to eight gigs of RAM and 256 gigs of storage kind of like what we talked about with the Moto G 5G you're going to be able to extend that if you need to um, as well yeah and we're also uh, we got some additional questions uh, so let's see uh, there's some questions about if it's going to be available on certain carriers uh, so right now it's going to be available on motorola.com it'll be unlocked it'll be unlocked so whichever carrier you have uh, it will be launching at several carriers you can find the list of those carriers on motorola.com so you can see if it will be coming uh, to a carrier near you uh, but again you can uh, register today for the Moto G 5G. So when it does become available, you will be able to purchase that device, again, unlocked. And if you're looking at the Moto G Stylus 5G that we just talked about, that is available to order today. Uh, so really good stuff there. Yeah, let's see. I see a couple more questions. Mm -hmm. um, someone's asking that if I lose my stylus, can I get a replacement anywhere? I think I submitted that question because <laughs> I'm notorious for misplacing pens with stylus i'm pretty good but yeah that's a good question is there an ability to, to yeah, get a if, replacement if you do lose your stylus unfortunately uh you can uh, purchase one on motorola.com uh, the phone does have a feature in it that I, I, once it hits what 15 minutes it starts looking for that stylus um so it well not looking for it you gotta look for it <laughs> but it's reminding you to look for that stylus altogether yeah. uh, but you can purchase one on motorola.com if you yeah. need a replacement and if you're like me uh once that replacement comes you'll probably find the other one but, but then you'll have two styluses, two styluses. yeah no, no one's mad about that no one's mad about uh, that uh the next question i see on here which is really important question does this device have nfc yes this does come with nfc which is awesome because this is our first moto g device that has the nfc wow. uh capability which is a game changer right a lot of things are converting into kind of that touchless pay um a lot of uh, transit systems are using this to kind of get on you know onto the trains and stuff so this is great that it does come with nfc uh but it also nfc is also used in other ways right you could right. uh you can turn on yours i can turn on mine you could share all those images of your dog all thousand of those images <laughs> uh quickly and efficiently with the nfc so yes love that uh great question uh because it is available on the moto g stylus 5g Let's see what other questions. Uh, so I see one here too about the stylus being compatible on social media platforms. So like Snapchat, TikTok, Instagram. Yeah, so the phone does recognize the stylus as kind of like your finger, so there shouldn't be any trouble with going on your favorite social media platforms. Um, so let's say when you're creating your next big TikTok, you can uh, go in there with that stylus. So this is a great device for content creators. Yeah, not only that, but also our camera. I think Motorola uh, has done an amazing job working with all of these platforms recently to make sure that our, our cameras are integrated right. into these platforms as well. So when you are using the camera on Snapchat or Instagram or TikTok, you're using all of those great capabilities from the Motorola cameras as well. So I love that uh, the stylus is compatible, but also our cameras are being integrated into those platforms. Yeah. And then last question that I see on here is something that we haven't touched upon yet um, is the software on this device and oh, yes. on both of the devices. Yeah. Both of these will come uh, out the box with Android 12. 
right? And when we were playing around with it, we both were Android 11 users. So we were, you know, playing around with the Android 12 and a lot of really cool features. It's very intuitive, yeah. a lot of uh, just design, the overall design. Motorola has been doing an amazing job with our My UX app. So that's uh, that little Motorola app that you see on all Motorola phones. You click on that. Uh, it has some great features for personalization. So you could customize fonts, your background colors, even your icon shapes, right? And now with Android 12, kind of marrying those two experiences together, now you have even more personalization right. uh, capabilities, more color backgrounds and stuff. So really great. Um, love a lot of the other features as well on Android 12. So you're not going to be uh, disappointed with uh, those upgrades and those new features. And it's beautiful. Actually, it just really beautiful on the phone. Yep, it looks great. Uh, let's see more questions. Yeah, let's see. Love the personalization as because default what's uh warranty uh that uh, you can find on motorola.com support. I think uh the bowling dog that is the best. It is it this is. is our little corgi buddy. Our corgi friend. Yeah, <laughs> he's always here. He brings always us luck. here. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. I think we're ready to uh pick a winner. I think we are. So yeah, I know they're randomizing uh, the questions from here, what we did earlier on Instagram. So we'll just wait, I think, in about, okay, let's see, it's coming up here. Yes, uh, we have a winner. It is from Instagram. So thank you so much uh, for participating earlier in the questions. Jay Grizzly. So Jay Grizzly, if you're right now watching a live stream, congratulations, my friend, you have won a Moto G Stylus 5G. Uh, awesome. That's really cool news for yeah, everybody who did not match. win. Uh, if you didn't win and you really want this device today, as I know I do, you can register, not register, you could actually order this phone uh, today. Again, you can register for the Moto G 5G. It has been our absolute pleasure uh, to be here presenting on these two new devices that we announced earlier today. Some really cool features. Again, um, I think there's you know something for everyone, especially with the yeah. 5G experience, really kind of uh, you know enhancing your phone, your overall phone experience. So thank you again for joining us. Um, we had a lot of fun. Danny, thank you for hanging yeah, out for a little for bit, sure. talking about some phones. Yeah, we'll see you next time. Thanks yep. again. Take care. Thank you so much. And make sure to register and order these phones. <laughs>